former Pakistan Prime Minister Imran Khan, who was granted bail by the Islamabad High Court in several cases, left the premises of the court to his residence in Lahore Seaman Park. The PTI chief left the Islamabad High Court premises in a security cavalcade in the wee hours on Saturday after two days of detention, Geo News reported. He was greeted all the way to Lahore by PTI supporters. Imran Khan took a road route to reach his Lahore residence, marking his return after a tumultuous period. The Islamabad High Court on Friday granted him protective bail for two weeks in a corruption case and barred the authorities from arresting the former Pakistan Premier in any case registered anywhere in the country until Monday. On his way to Lahore, Imran Khan said, We are en route to Lahore by the grace of God. IG Islamabad tried his best to stop me in Islamabad, he blocked me for three hours. When I said I'll tell the whole of Pakistan that you have kidnapped me, then he released me. By persuading him that we would inform the entire Pakistani nation about his act of kidnapping and forcefully detaining us, we managed to secure our release, Khan stated. Under pressure, he eventually permitted our departure, he added. Imran Khan had remained inside for hours after being granted bail, saying he was not being allowed to leave by security officials. However, the court granted him bail the Al Qadir Trust corruption case, and the court ordered authorities to refrain from arresting Khan until May 17 in any new case. Furthermore, he obtained bail until May 22 in the Zilli Shah murder case, while another bench barred his arrest until May 15 in three terrorism cases, Geo News reported. Khan welcomed the court's order and said the judiciary was Pakistan's only protection against the law of the jungle. I must say I expected this from our judiciary, because the only hope now left, the only thin line between a banana republic and a democracy is the judiciary, he told journalists inside the court premises. Imran Khan's arrest last week in the Al Qadir Trust case from outside the Islamabad court premises led to violent clashes, but the Supreme Court of Pakistan subsequently declared the arrest illegal. The IHC's decision to grant Khan a two-week reprieve from arrest came hours after he warned of countrywide unrest if he was arrested again. Khan is facing over 120 cases across the country, including for allegedly committing treason and blasphemy and inciting violence and terrorism.